Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hard drives can get corrupted, and uh, they're full of sectors that sometimes just go bad. Not much you can do about it, but you can do your best to keep things in check. You'll understand that reference in just a second. Community member at large who goes by the handle Drizzt. At least that's the handle he used when he came to our chat room at live.perillo.com to ask this. Hey, Chris, I tried to defrag my computer, and it says Disk Defragmenter has detected that check disk is scheduled to run on the volume C. Please run check disk slash F. What does that mean? Or what do I do to be able to defrag my computer? Well, if your computer is telling you that check disk is scheduled to run on the volume, uh, let it run on the volume. Let it run on that particular drive letter. In this case, it would be drive letter C, volume C. Uh, that is a hard disk, or at least part of a hard disk. Um, check disk is a utility that will scan and verify the integrity of your directory structures, your folder structures, if you will, uh, file locations, uh, and s sometimes could possibly even recover uh, data that was corrupted in however it may have been corrupted in transmission and copying and just general usage. And in some cases, uh, a hard disk, the entire disk may not fail, but certain parts of that disk, certain sectors on that disk may be deemed bad. And when they are deemed bad and labeled bad, the operating system should not, and, and, and may in many cases after it's been scanned and labeled as such, will not write to those bad sectors on the hard drive. And the check disk utility built into Windows, uh, although I'll show you a couple ways of uh, getting to it, um, it will scan, in some cases fix, that's the, that slash F that you were referring to, fix any possible corruption and uh, recover those files, although they may not be usable, uh, the data that w were part of those files can certainly be recovered from uh, any kind of corruption that may have taken place. And defrag can't run, because remember, the defrag utility is there to defragment uh, files uh, that are on your hard, uh, that's on, that may be on your hard drive, or that are, uh, I should say. Sorry, it's a little late at night. Um, the utility itself, uh, though, needs to make sure that the files are where they are being reported as, as being located, at least as far as your operating system, in this case Windows, is concerned. So to open up check, check disk, um, and it looks like this one was scheduled to run on the next reboot, which is cool for you, uh, but if you want to run it on demand, uh, open up my computer, right click one of your hard disks, and go to properties. Flip over to the Tools tab, and under the Error Checking section, press the Check Now button. Now, there's another way of getting directly to this uh, from the Start menu, but I like showing people exactly where it is, not just the shortcut. Uh, and then from there, you can automatically fix file system errors or scan and attempt recovery of bad sectors. And that's probably going to take a long time, depending, of course, on the size of your hard drive. Uh, there are other ways, like I said, of getting to it. Uh, one, of, one of the ways is uh, going and opening a command prompt and typing in chkdsk, check disk, uh, running the utility from there. And uh, it's a little more uh, verbose than you might experience uh, from doing it in Windows. Yeah, because I'm not really seeing anything until I think I get to the final screen, the, uh, the, the report screen. Um, anyway, I don't know if anybody else has any tips or tricks on check disk or defragging or generally making sure that your hard drive is safe and sound or as safe as it possibly can be. Uh, by all means, leave a suggestion, uh, a comment, a follow-up, uh, or you know, a video response. You can send me an email, chris at perillo.com. And of course, you're always welcome to join us in our community. Uh, this is where people ask questions all the time, and in some cases, I may be able to answer them. So uh, let's see here. What, what else was I going to tell you? Oh, where we're located. Where can we be found? I mean, yeah, we're on YouTube, but I mean, where are we chatting 24 hours a day? Where is it? I know. I just had the URL. I know it. Oh, yeah, that's right. Live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.